Hello my beauties and this gonna be compatibility reading. I'm going to dive into com compatibility between Liam and his ex-wife and Liam and his girlfriend. Okay, patterns I did notice there. First of all, Liam himself, if you will build his destiny matrix, you will see energy 8 on his love line. Uh, energy 8 always always in a karmic relationship uh, if it's good karma those relationship will unfold in a good positive way but if it's negative karma um, you will be in a marriage like an open air prison for example yeah like lolo L let's take example of lolo and why i got um, attracted by this lion case is because lion's destiny matrix is similar to lolo's destiny matrix and we have tons and tons of videos analyzing lolo destiny matrix tons of videos and lion and lolo they literally where are lolo they literally have money line same love line love line love line same Lolo matrix, yeah. Uh, everything, money line same, karmic tail same, core energy same. Only different visit card and then here, here, yeah. So Liam <clears throat> and uh, and by the way, degeneracy program that Lolo inherited from his mama side, Liam have it too in his destiny matrix. It's degen degeneracy or extinction of a king, and him having this program. I would be observing his son destiny as well because quite often quite often people of um, people <laughs> children of such people like Liam Lola unfortunately they not ending um, well in life okay they are not ending well in life especially okay especially if you have this degeneracy program at the bottom yeah or on love line bottom of matrix it's gonna hit your children as well if you have in here mostly it's gonna be through career by the way donald trump i think the case with career we will be analyzing more of, of trump kamala matrices i'm planning to so girls and guys lion's case like for me like whoo this is like a pre uh, like trailer of what may happen to lolo in his happy marriage yeah and I'm sorry, okay, let me let me observe what they showing me, what the spirit guys in higher powers they showing me some type of trailer because Lola is you know former addict and I'm highly questioning the word former in this sentence because each and every date when um, <laughs> confirmation my friend just wrote me that in language class um, Afghani guy tried to harass her in America she's going she relocated to United States and she's writing me Kate what what is happening today in terms of energies that Afghani guy tried to harass me in language class wow amazing amazing Lola is Afghani <sighs> yeah and she's writing on, on his IQ. Anyway, so um, here we go. Liam and his ex-wife and girlfriend. What was in common? Uh, what was in common to my short video that I made already that with last girlfriend, he had suicide program, literally. And me, myself, I have the same with Lolo. And Lolo was literally pushing me towards suicide. And he was doing a really great job, uh, constantly pouring into my ears. You lonely old bitch. You will die with 50 cats. 50 cats gonna eat your dead body starting from your Jewish nose. Even though I'm not Jewish, but you know, the Lulus love to fantasize. Ma Mama of Lolo is the Lulu woman, 1899 program, and the Lulus they injected um, their children with this pattern, you know. So Lola loves to fantasize as well about things that are not there. Anyway, anyway, here we go compatibility with these two women. Uh, okay, I will start with Liam and Cheryl. What is literally here? You you can Google her date of birth. Mm. So all relationship for Liam with energy eight in his love line karmic. And here we have not easy compatibility. 
energy 16 uh, in the core. Energy of destruction, energy of tower, energy of big baboom. Very powerful, very conflicted, uh, conflicting, fueled by strong energy 21. Strong energy 21 in the compatibility planetary and on Earth line. In planetary, he had the same strong 21 with his uh, girlfriend Katie, with whom he had a suicide program in compatibility. With Katie. And for me, it was like, you know, uh, my name is Kate, Catherine. For me, it was another sign. Someone like Lolo, Liam, Liam Lolo. And here, my personal story, I'm Katie. I'm, I'm like, what? How she pushed him to... What, what was going on that, that he accidentally died, you know? Mm, definitely they first saw contracts as like suicide, literally. And Lola was pushing me. One in a couple will be pushing another one to suicide. If pro if program is in minus, I'm telling you. If program is in plus, uh, Lion would be healing his addictions ne next to her. And uh, unlocking his uh, talents and full potential because he had strong allowance in his destiny matrix and this is energy of potential, great potential, great talent, <sighs> karmic tale, unlocked talent, next to her he's supposed to um, shine and become even more prominent than Harry Styles for example, yeah, but he didn't, for some reasons he ended up like in, in a very horrible way, but next to her He's supposed to. That was plus scenario, you know? Unlocked, unrealized talent program. And by the way, with his wife Cheryl, ex-wife, he had the same unlocked uh, talent program, but on love line. Here with uh, girlfriend Katie, he had in comic tale this program and on love line. And for me, this is confirmation. Okay, you're breaking up with Cheryl. Definitely you're not working on your love line unlocked talent because you being what ignorant ignorant six or fourteen and eight this is dictatorship karmite. You enter in another relationship where it's highlighted that energies that you fucked up are six, seventeen, and eleven in previous relationship. You fucked up on all these energies. You dive into minuses of all those energies. You, you did not unlock a great talent that was given to you. You, you did not become greater than heavy styles, for example. You did not. But you, you had this talent. You had this potential. Why the hell you was not doing this? So probably somewhere he was choosing a females that are messed up in minuses as well. And the influence was negative on him. Anyway... So here we go, the same energy 21 um, in planetary. How it is um, dangerous? Uh, they were, uh, as far as I know, all of them, uh, no, ra uh, no racial differences, no religious differences, no social class differences, to say that it was very big social class di difference, yeah, that, to say that she literally like uh, from poverty comes, uh, as far as Sai Hohold goes, maybe you know better his biography and biography of his girlfriends. But no racial differences, no religious differences, zero differences at all. So, energy 21, and this is very powerful energy for compatibility. It's gonna play in minus. It's gonna create a conflict uh, around miserable things. Very, very little things will trigger you, will start triggering you when you're next to each other. Very little. The, the way is your partner look at you or the way he's scratching his ear, is, is everything gonna irritate you? Because there are no differences, no social class differences, no occupation differences. If, if for example, his girlfriend Katie was like geek or programmer or IT something, yeah? Something very different to him, something very logical. Energy 21 influence would be in a plus for this couple. For any of their couples, Energy 21 wasn't in plus. 